What is going on, guys? Evolution here, and we are back with some more Ark on the map, Cabalus. I hope everyone is having a great day. So last episode, we tried to help out the tribe a little bit more, and I want to continue that today. So we're going to head out. We're going to try and tame up some Dodicarus. I know they've been a little cursed on the server. I don't think anyone's actually done it yet. Not that I'm aware of anyway. So we're going to go out. We're going to try and find a breeding pair. So we can finally get some proper stone production going. And then after that, I would love to head to the top left to the winter biome and potentially tame up some penguins so we can have organic polymer on hand all the time. I feel like that would be very useful. So that's the plan. That's the idea. We'll see how far we get. Also, before I forget, Syntac also gifted us an Ascendant shotgun. Very kind of him. So I've crafted up some shells so we can have a little fun when we're out and about. We got some simple shotgun ammo right there. And is there anything else that we can maybe craft up to upgrade our gear here just a bit? We could probably make some fur if we're going to the winter biome. That might not be a bad idea so we're not freezing the whole time. We also have this Mastercraft fabricated pistol we could craft up. We got that from a drop. So let's maybe grab this out of there and that and that. Is there anything else? Oh, you know what? We could probably use a new hatchet, considering we're only using the default one still. So let's grab you. And I think that's it for now. Ooh, we do have an Ascendant Dodix saddle that we could craft up once we actually tame up some Dodix. I'm not going to craft it just now, otherwise we're going to jinx ourselves. So let's just hold off on that and get a crafting potion going. Oh, we should probably be close to the bench that we're actually going to craft things in. So let's just stay here for a moment and let's throw all this in. Like so. Now we can get this potion crafted up. And let's take it. And... Oh no, I don't want to do 100 of those. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, it's fine. I don't think we're going to need the full set. The two ascended pieces should do just fine. And let's go ahead and craft up one of these hatchets. We should be able to do that. We can. Okay. Ooh, 14% crafting bonus? That is horrible. What did we get on our pants? 12%? Ouch. And we got 28 on the gloves. I will take those on the gauntlets. We can't actually move them to our inventory because we're two way down. Let's actually just get rid of these structures for the moment. And maybe that and that. Get rid of it all because I want to actually be able to go to the other side of the room. Can we move? We can. All the way to the fabricator because we're going to make up one of these pistols. I haven't actually used a fabricated pistol in a long time. I just know that the shotguns are usually just the way. They absolutely destroy. And the pistols, they're eh. They're, they're not as amazing. But I'm hoping this is going to be somewhat decent. So let's see if we can craft one of you. We can. And boom, craft. Come on, good bonus. Ooh, 33%. I will absolutely take that. I'm a big fan. So we have that now. And all we need to do is craft up a little bit of ammo for this. Which shouldn't be too bad. Let's just do 200. Okay, so we have a lot of stuff on us. And we're pretty heavy at the moment but that's okay. Uh, I've also got all the kibbles that we're going to need. We have basic kibble for the penguins. I believe that's what they take. And then we have the regular kibble for the dodicaruses. We should be good there. And then I have superior kibble just in case we come across anything that we'd like to tame. So now we're ready to head out. So let's go ahead and just jump off. Let's head over to the danger zone and uh, hopefully we find some decent things to tame. So there is a Deinonychus right in front of us. I feel like this is the perfect opportunity to try out this weaponry. So let's just go up here. I'm not afraid whatsoever. I have full confidence that we're going to be okay. Even though Deinonychus are a little scary. Oh, get destroyed. Not even a opportunity for it. Just absolutely melted. Hey, okay, shotgun seems good. It passes the test. Now we just have to try out the fabricated pistol. Okay, we got a thorny dragon here. Let's absolutely destroy this thing. Wait. What? It does 200 damage a shot? Okay, well, um... That was the thing that just happened. I can't believe we just one-shot it. I actually don't even understand what just happened. Let's get this RG as well. Okay, we missed a little bit. It's fine. Reload. Oh, ruined. Absolutely ruined. That was also a 108, so it wasn't a horrible level. Not like an amazing level, but not horrible. Let's get the scorpion. If we can. Oh, we're only doing 80. Okay. 
It's dead. Hey, the simple pistol's not bad. It's actually not bad. We melt that thorny dragon. I think those are headshots. I think that's why we're we're doing so well. Yeah, absolutely they're headshots. I have a feeling I'm gonna fall in love with this pistol. I need to get like an ascendant one now though. I want like 350, 400% damage. I'd be very happy with that. Okay, we have two Dodicaruses here. Are they decent? No. 66 and you are 24. Okay. Not even gonna bother trying to get them out of this area. They can just die. Oh, we have a couple Dodicaruses right in front of us. What do we have? A 168 female. Okay. And a 174 female? No way. Is this, is this for real? And these guys are untouched. They're just chilling. What are you? Are you going to be amazing? A 108 male. Okay. Uh, I guess we should try and tame up both of these. If I'm being completely honest, let's go ahead and just start tranking them. I don't think I'm going to cage them or anything like that. The area itself seems pretty safe. So let's just get in the do, do the things. Shoot you in the face. You're not going to be able to catch me. I'm much too fast. There, doe dick. You guys could try. I wonder how many tranks it's going to take. Because this thing does like 210%. So it shouldn't actually be that many. Maybe 15. That's going to be my best guess. Potentially a little bit more. I kind of want to just keep cutting them in this area though. I don't want to go any farther. So we're just going to do circles. Just doing the circles. Because they can't turn properly. So they'll never actually catch me. It's a little bit sad. They just have no control over this situation whatsoever. So this one's running. It should be out very soon. Then we can start on the 174. There we go. Now it's your turn. And we rinse and repeat what we just did. Oh, there we go. You're out. You're sleepy. Okay, let's throw the kibble in the first one here. I don't know how many it's going to take. So we'll just throw all 17 in to get an idea. 13%. Okay, so it's going to take eight more, right? Maybe. So this is a great start. We have two high-level females down. Now we just need to find a high-level male, and then we'll be golden. Assuming both of these guys make it and don't get attacked out of the blue by some crazy scorpion or carno or whatever else is in the area. Ooh, I've spotted an RG close by. He's not coming to ruin my tames. There's no way. We're just going to destroy him. Like he's nothing because he is and uh continue guarding and there we go we've got our first dodicarus up absolutely amazing 251 yeah you're tamed i see that you're tamed calm down dino tracker just calm down let's go ahead and pick you up and see what your stats are like i'm hoping they're good uh 40 health 50 stam okay 30 oxygen, 30 food, 31 weight, and 40 melee, 29 movement speed. So honestly, it's a pretty good Dodicarus. It's actually not bad whatsoever. I kind of wish the weight was a little higher, but other than that, it's fantastic. And there we go. The second Dodic is up. Absolutely beautiful. And we're going to go ahead and pick you up. You are the higher level, so you should have better stats. Is that actually going to be true? I don't know. Ooh, interesting. Okay, so we have 39 health, 34 stam, 36 oxygen, 25 food, 50 weight, 30 melee, 45 movement speed. So this one has the weight, which is really good. And this has amazing stam. So if we get a male with amazing melee, we are on the verge of an incredible dodic. Okay, let's continue our search. So far, we're not cursed when it comes to dodicaruses, which is, uh, it's very good. Very happy about that. Okay, we've got a death worm. Um, I kind of want to take it out, but at the same time, I'm a little bit afraid to do it by myself. Maybe we'll be okay. It does 78. That's actually not that bad. And we've got the bleed. We're doing 350. Oh, we've got this. We've absolutely got this. No longer afraid. Easy peasy. It's already bloody. Carno's OP. Can you just die though? I feel like we should just stand still and stop pushing it forward. Oh, now I can't attack it. Okay, never mind. We're just gonna keep pushing forward. We're just moving with you. 
death worm moving with you and you should die now yes beautiful absolutely beautiful let's grab your your goodies we are having really bad luck with the dodicaruses we have a 66 here and a 18 oh no that is not what we want okay so i'm not really having any luck in this biome so i think we're just gonna head up to the winter biome right away and maybe we'll find a good male dodic there and if not there's a redwoods biome right beside it and there's always a bunch of dodics in that biome Ooh, we found some more dodicaris there's actually three in front of me 54 female not great and you are a 108 female Ooh, there's four never mind 102 oh never mind there's so many okay there's way more oh my goodness okay that's a lot of mean carnivores get off the dodicaruses even though that one's only a level 18 it's still rude let's just kill every single one of you um it kind of sucks that all of these dodicaris were horrible considering there was what six in the area and not one of them was good we got a very cool looking tech rex here and it's a 129 never mind it is hot potato there's a paleo kentro it's a 108 oh more dodicaris 60 and 108 so they may all be horrible levels but it's a really good place for finding them at least so that's something oh that is a alpha raptor okay let's go ahead and kill you give me some uh some loot and some levels definitely never gonna complain about that yeah you're not very tough you can try and attack me oh you just got behind me okay you're intelligent well not very strong but you are intelligent i will give you that let's go ahead and see what kind of loot you've got for us Ooh, that was not uh that was not good i'm gonna take those trank arrows and that's about it okay we are officially on the border of the winter biome i'm hoping our fur is gonna keep us nice and warm looks like it's doing the job already and immediately there's a dodicarus right in front of us are you gonna be amazing nope you sure aren't i think we've seen about 60 or 70 dodicarus now and um no good males there were so many dodicarus just going through all those different biomes and we still have had horrible luck so let's just climb the mountain to get a lay of the land here and look what's below us that is absolutely terrifying there are so many ice wyverns down there the ruins area looks really cool um oh my goodness look at all of them there's so many i guess that's the ice wyvern trench i'm assuming we're definitely not going down there we're not ready for any of that maybe one day we'll come back and uh, do that trench because it looks like absolute chaos i can't wait for that Ooh, look what we found some sort of penguin looking thing it waddles kind of funny i have no idea how to pronounce that but i believe this creature is from the animals of atlas mod if i'm not mistaken maybe we can just trank it and try and tame it it's a 150 which seems pretty good oh it's it would attacks that is rude i just want to be your friend and you were just pecking me okay i'm just standing in front of it so it doesn't go off the cliff here and it's out I wonder what kind of kibble you're going to take. What if we give you some basic kibble? Are you going to be basic? I have no idea what this thing does, but I want it. I hope we can have it as like a shoulder pet. That would be kind of cool. Little penguin on our shoulder. Oh, if I would have paid attention while opening up its inventory, I would have seen that you can make polymer in here from their eggs. That's very interesting. I wonder how fast they produce eggs because that could be really strong. Are you going to tame up? You are. Okay, maybe this is not the right kibble. Let's put in some superior kibble. Maybe this is going to be the way because that took away taming effectiveness. Okay, that kibble took away more? That's not the right stuff either. This might be a waste of kibble because we're just going to destroy its taming effectiveness. 
but I still want it. So we're just gonna tame it up anyway and see exactly what it's all about. Cause I just, I wanna know for science. Ooh, I've spotted a Kairuku. That's exciting. It's only a level 18 and I kind of want a higher level than that. How did I not notice these things before? They're literally right beside me. Like actually right beside this penguin. Um, I guess I was just so focused on the big one that I didn't notice the small ones. So let's just go ahead and have a little look here. See if any of these are actually a decent level. 18. That would be a no. 114. 54. Okay. Nothing uh, too great, to be honest. Oh, there's a bunch below us. What level are you? A 180? Okay. Okay, we're, uh, we're just going down there. We're just immediately going down there. We have a bulla. Yes, we do. Okay. So let's throw that on so we can just thank you like so. That way you can't run from us. And then we're going to shoot you in the face with one of these darts. And you should actually go down. Maybe two. Can we reload this? Thank you. One more dart in your face. Okay, maybe a third. Wow, you're tanky. Five. Yes. Okay, there's the magic number. You are out. We're going to put our basic kibble in you. Looks like the female has already tamed up, which is amazing. Uh, let's go ahead and just pick you up and check out your stats. Let's see. 46 health, 38 stam, 40 oxygen, 27 food, 37 weight, 38 melee, and 42 movement speed. So health is really all we want, and we got that. That's, uh, that's really good health. I'm really happy with that. And there we go. We've got this weird penguin thing up, and it's, uh, it's pick upable. Okay. Let's pick you up. Oh, wait, what's happening? What is it? Is it hug? Oh, we're hugging it. That's actually very, uh, very cute. I do like that. And is it giving us a buff? Warm hugs make you feel good. Penguin. That's true, actually. Hugs, uh, hugs are very good for you. All right, can we, can we throw you down? Can you not hug me there for a moment? I don't like that it's so in your face. Uh, where are you going? Are you just, you're on an adventure? You're just going to go in that direction somewhere? You're happy doing that? I won't stop you. I will definitely not stop you. Okay, stop. All right, now we just need to get a female one of these, and then we can figure out how everything's going to work. But it's, uh, it's nice that we get some free hugs. Ooh, we seem to be stumbling upon some ruins, and that kind of excites me. I love that giant head statue. That looks really good. Let's head inside here. Is this just like a little tunnel to get to the other side of the mountain? Seems like it. Still have some more ruins. We got some stairs here. Okay. Ooh, this is, uh, this is very fancy. It goes up super high. Does it actually lead anywhere? There's just a griffin. What is that griffin doing? What were you doing, sir? You just having a little nap? Just a little tiny nap? Oh, this is a big place. Okay, so we got stairs and looks like maybe a couple rooms down there. Or we can continue to go straight up. Let's go straight up. Okay, so we have another path here in front of us. There seems to be like a little cave. Oh, this is kind of cool. Is this ice? It is. Well, that's, um, that's very interesting. I do like this. Can we grab these silica pearls through the ice? Oh, they're black pearls? Wait, there's black pearls? Just like here? Out and about? Doing their own thing? Well, that seems very strong. We grab you? No, okay. There's not a lot we can grab. So it's not like the most OP thing in the world, but we're still getting a decent amount. Okay, I think I picked up all I could pick up. How many did we get in total? Wow, 555. That's crazy. That was the easiest black pearl farm I've ever done in my entire life. Let's go ahead and throw on the GPS and see exactly where this spot is. We need to remember to come back here. So we are at 6.8 latitude and 22.3 longitude. Got it. Let's, uh, let's continue going up here. And there seems to be another ice cave. What's in here? crystal wow okay that's a lot of crystal in the water still haven't seen any loot i bet you we missed something down below so we're at the bottom portion of the structure now and it looks like it even goes down farther which is kind of crazy does this lead anywhere 
Ooh, there's a big cave here. Okay. Um, I don't see anything there. Well, the lighting changed. That's a little spooky. Is this like a proper cave? Looks like we can go in the water here. What do we have in here? We have a little bit of metal and I don't see anything dangerous. Should we just jump in? You know what? Let's do it. Let's see what we got underneath the ice. Ooh, this looks really cool. We got crystal. We got metal nodes. And it seems to go on for quite a while. We also have silica pearls, right? These aren't black pearls, surely. Yeah. Oh, they are black pearls. I was so confident that they were going to be silica pearls. But we're just getting all the black pearls. Oh, no. Oh, we're in trouble, though. We are about to run out of air. Can we get some more air over here? That would be great. That would be ideal. I don't want to die in this cave. All right, let's continue exploring the top portion of the cave. It looks like it actually goes quite deep. We got some water in here. Okay. And does this go out to like the ocean? Is that where we're going right now? Or yes, we are. We're out in the ocean. That was cool though. Definitely a worthwhile cave if you need resources in your life. So we got a little distracted by the cave, but we're back on track looking for some more Kairuku. Finding a good level male is seemingly impossible at the moment. I don't know why. 162 female... What do we have here? Ooh, a 156 male. That's not as good as I would like, but it's still pretty decent. That's also a 174 female. Please be a good male. 24. You know what? We're going to go ahead and tame up the 156 and the 174 female. The male is not exactly what I want, but honestly, it's better than nothing. Having a backup plan is always good. So let's give you five kibble and we'll give you five kibble and you guys should tame up with no problems what is happening there's a dillo here and you're attacking me you think you can attack me no chance no whoa whoa carno car carno whoa buddy you were so close to making a huge mistake that was not okay it's just a corpse Take a chill pill. Okay, so we have the first one up. We're just waiting on the female now. It shouldn't be too much longer. Let's actually take out the extra kibble. You only need one more. What are your stats like? Let's see. Um, 32 health, 30 stam, 34 oxygen, 28 food, 37 weight, 39 melee, and 32 movement speed. And boom, there we go. The female is up. I think we're doing okay penguin wise. I'll just check a couple more areas here. See if we can find a better level male. And if not, we're going to head over to the redwood biome and continue looking for a male Dodicarus. Is that still on the to-do list? Ooh, we have stumbled upon a new ruins area. And it looks very exciting. Let's go ahead and just see what we have here. We've got like some blue haired Equus. Oh, there's a Uteranus here. Okay. You know what? We're just going for it. I'm not afraid. Yeah, you buffed this Carno. It's okay. He's dead. Now we're killing you. Oh, don't you dare fear us. If you fear us before we kill you, I'm going to be very upset. Don't do it. Don't you dare. Oh, come on. Please don't go off the cliff. Just stay stuck. Okay. Um. Let's just do that. Oh, and this Uteranus wants us. Where did it go? I don't actually know. Uteranus, is that you? My Carno's down there somewhere. Oh, here it is. You better not be able to eat me through this wall. That would not be great. Just fire everything at it. Maybe the shotgun would be more effective. Let's pull that out. Let's give it a reload. Hey, buddy. Do you like that? Oh, it was a 174. Why don't we check levels? I feel like you guys need to yell at me more to just check levels. Just remind me. Okay, so where the heck did my Carno go? Is it all the way down here? Oh, I think it is. Okay. Let's fly down. Here we go. 
We're coming, Carno. Okay, so what do we got going on up here? Is it just like a, a cool ruins location with nothing really else going on? Is there loot here? This looks like a potential loot spot. Maybe. Oh, there's like a, a fire. And some human skulls and a guy stabbed and frozen without a head. And then we have like a pride rock just looking over the water. Very cool. What is that over there? Are those purple mushrooms? Okay. They're all just in a circle. That's so very strange. Well, kind of a circle. I don't know. It looked like a circle like this. And then as soon as I took out the spyglass, it no longer looks like a circle. There's also a thyla there that disappeared. That was interesting. Okay, so we're actually really close to a point of interest that I wanted to check out last episode, but we didn't get around to it because we got distracted by everything else. So I'm going to try and see if we can get to it now. And I believe it's right in front of us. Oh yeah, okay. I see mushrooms. Let's um, go around to this side and see exactly what we have going on here. This looks uh, very cool. Oh, honey. Okay. This is like a giant beehive. Is this what this is? Oh, there's lots of bugs. I don't know if we're ready for bugs. Let's, uh, let's see what we can do here. Oh, this is like a proper cave. Oh no. Okay. Okay. We're backing up. We're backing up. We're backing up. Oh, please be gentle. Be gentle. I get it. You guys are, you're hungry. You're aggressive. I didn't mean to go in here. I'm sorry. I didn't know this was like a, a proper cave. We are 100% going to come back and do this with the guys. I just want to take like a little sneaky peek in and see how crazy this is going to be. Oh, wow. It's very deep. It's very deep. It's very intimidating. Oh, we've spotted an alpha Carno. Okay. Uh, I need that in my life. We 100% are going to fight this. I think we're okay on HP. What level is it? Is it like scary level? Or is it little baby? It's a 168. Uh, okay. Confidence is shaken a little bit, but we're going to be fine. Let's get in here. We'll just keep it at bay. Keep backing up. And we should be okay. Just like this. Here we go. This is going well. Absolutely okay. Get that bleed going again. Oh, it's not even a challenge. No challenge. I bet you it's almost halfway dead already. Okay, the Titan Manira coming in. I don't like that. That's my stam drainage. Not a fan. Get that bleed going again. Oh, we messed up. We messed up. We mistimed the clicks there. There we go. We're back in control. There's something. Oh my. There's a Dinosuchus right there and it's just hit me. Okay. Okay, we're panicking a little bit. It, it giga bit me, which is not ideal. It's really trying to get me now. How's this Carno looking? I don't think it's bloody yet. Not that I could tell. Yeah, we need to find a... Oh, it is? Oh, it is bloody? Okay. Oh, I shouldn't have bled it. I wanted to get the last hit. That is... Uh, that's dicey. Yeah. That was a mistake. 100% a mistake. And wow, what... What is that loot? So we seem to have stumbled across like a giant dump or something. I don't know. It's glowing. And there's green rocks inside. Okay, what is this? What are you? Ambergris. Ooh, okay. And element shards. This is kind of a cool little spot. Nice little resource spot. Where exactly is this located? So we can remember this for next time. 55.9 latitude and 49.6 longitude. Okay. Okay, we're still not having a lot of luck with the Dodicaruses. It's kind of getting sad now. I'm getting a little depressed. Oh, never mind. Okay. Excuse me? Excuse me, Dodicarus? What level are you? Uh, I can't even... I can't even... I can't even believe there's a 174. Okay, we need to deal with these aloes right away. Let's just... Let's just destroy you. 
I don't even care about the Ankies. I think there's like a 174 in here as well, but we're going to kill you. Doesn't matter. You're dead to me, Anki. I'm so freaking happy right now. If only you guys understood how many Dodics I've actually killed and seen. It's been ridiculous. There has just been no good level males whatsoever. I've seen a couple high level females, but males have just been non-existent. But we found one. We actually found one. Let's go ahead and get this guy tranked. Um, did the Dodic just hop? I didn't know they could jump. Okay, we got Kibble in you. Now we just need you to tame up and have super amazing melee. Okay, this thing should tame up any second. Holy moly, I'm excited. Come on, just get up. It's right now. I believe you can do it. Yes. Okay. We finally got a 260 male Dodicarus. We're going to pick you up. Fingers are crossed. High melee. High melee. Everybody fake it. Just high melee. That's what we want. That's what we need. Come on. Oh, no. Not high melee. We needed better than 40. Honestly, I'm, uh, I'm very happy with the progress today. We got our Dodix, which I'm super happy about. I was so ready to give up on that male Dodic. I did not think it was going to happen, but then it did. We got our Kairukus. We got our penguins, which is amazing. We even got a penguin that hugs us, and nothing's better than a hug. We are home. We are back at the base. Everyone is ready to start breeding, but I think that's actually going to be it for this episode. So remember to smash that like button and remember to subscribe if you guys have not already because it seriously helps me out. It really does. And I'm a little sad that we couldn't find a female hugging penguin. So we can't breed up these guys, unfortunately, but we will definitely head back down there at some point and hopefully get one of them. Have a good one. See ya.